welcome to Daring Marana YouTube channel. Today we will be discussing about centrifugal purifier, their basic principle and working. So let's move on to the topic centrifugal purifier. So before going to centrifugal purifier, we need to show we need to know some basic what is the purifier, their basic gravity separation and all. So let's start from the little basics. Gravity separation means consider a tank having a mixture of water, sludge, oil, dirt, etc. Over a period of time, the solid particles settle at the bottom and oil will be at the top, which means later liquid will be at the top and heavier liquid will be at the bottom. Now, small calls, classes and all, we study with school classes, we study the gravity separation and all. Consider a tank having a mixture of water, there will be a sludge, oil, dirt, etc. Over a period of time, the solid particles will settle at the bottom and oil will be at the top, which means the later liquid will be at the top and heavier liquids will be at the later liquids will be uh, which means later liquid will be at the top and heavier liquids will be at the bottom okay separating force is defined by the stroke's law that means f is equal to pi by 6 d cube by rho w minus rho 0 into g that means stroke's law this separating force is defined by this law that means oil and uh, the oil and heavy solid particle separation from this stroke's law we find out F s is equal to stroke's force is equal to pi by 6 into d cube rho w minus rho 0 into g. In gravitation suppression, this gravity is responsible for suppression speed, which is a fixed because in a, we know that gravity is a fixed, it does not change in earth. In, in the gravitation suppression, the gravity is responsible for suppression speed, which is fixed value. Here we can see in the in like I mentioned, light phase will be oil on the top, and heavy that means heavy phase is water and solids will be on the accumulator on the bottom. Okay. Then centrifugal purifiers. Centrifuge is the process by which effects of gravity can be amplified by the use of centrifugal force to the extent that separation process becomes rapid and continuous. Okay, centrifuge is the centrifugal purifier is nowadays using centrifuge is a process by which the effect of gravity can be amplified very fast by use of centrifugal force to the extent that separation process becomes rapid and continuous. Separation process will be very rapid and continuous. Centrifuge work by rapidly spinning a bowl containing liquid, thus producing required centrifugal force to produce separation. So we can replace gravitational force to centrifugal force, that means omega square r. So separating force will be f is equal to pi by 6 d cube into rho w minus rho 0 into omega square r. Okay. In the case of gravity separation, there will be f is equal to pi by 6 into d cube rho w minus rho o into g here there will be omega square the gravitational force is replaced by omega square that is centrifugal force here centrifuge work by rapidly spinning a bowl containing the liquid thus producing the required centrifugal force to produce suppression okay here centrifuge is the process by which effects of gravity can be amplified by the use of centrifugal force to the extent that separation process become rapid and it will be continuous the centrifuge work by rapidly spinning a bowl containing the liquid thus producing the required centrifugal force to produce separation so here what happened is the gravitation force is replaced with centrifugal force that means by omega square omega square r here we can say the late phase is oil that will be at the center and heavy phase will be this and solids will be at, at the at the corner will be the heavy accumulator in the corner so heavy uh, solid central will be accumulator at the corner during the centrifugal separation and all the principle of operation of the centrifuge is simple. When a bowl containing impure fuel is rotated, centrifugal forces will throw any item with density greater than fuel density to the periphery of the bowl. Here the principle is, is very simple. Means when a bowl is rotating, so the, when the bowl containing impure fuel is rotated, so due to centrifugal force, it will throw any item with density greater than fuel density to the periphery of the bowl. So the way means oil and free water will be towards the center, rest of the solid will be at the periphery of the bowl. So working of a marine purifier, the centrifugal purifier or separator consists of a bowl containing a set of discs stacked one on top of other. We know, we know that centrifugal purifier or separator consists of number of bowls contains a set of discs stacked one on the top of other. Dirty oil flows down the distributor and up through the holes of the disc. The dirty oil will flow down to the distributor up the holes in the discs. Okay, working of marine purifier means centrifugal purifier or separator consists of bowl containing a set of discs 
stacked on top of the other. The dirty oil flows down the distributor and up the through the holes in the disc. Here we can see the principle of picture of a marine purifier. Here we can see late phase diagram, heavy phase overflow, centrifugal pump, ceiling will be there, bowl closing water trapped, water distributor will be there, splint port closed, small orifice for leaks and all disc stacks will be there. So after passing down the central passage, so then the after passing down to central passage, untreated oil is carried by centrifugal force towards the periphery of the ovoid and then passes up through disc stack. So here what happening is when through a central passage it will go, the, then the untreated oil is carried by centrifugal force to the periphery of the bowl. They, due to the force, they will throw to the periphery of the bowl and then pass through disc stack. Where the actual suppression to the, through the disc stack, disc stack, the actual suppression is takes place in the channel formed between two discs. Two forces act on each solid or liquid particle. So the two forces will act on each solid and liquid particle. The particle is pushed upwards with the oil stream towards center, while the centrifugal force directly to periphery. Okay, that means the particle will push upward with oil stream towards center. Okay, but due to centrifugal force, it is moved to the periphery. So that separation is effectively taking place. The residual force on denser particles, that means impurities will drive them towards periphery. Due to residual force of denser particle, or impurities inside them will drive them to the periphery, while dense, less dense particle will drive it towards center of the board. Air raised to the outlet connection. Separated heavy liquid continuously going to the sludge tank through heavy liquid outlet and late liquid gets separated out to service tank. In particular intervals, bowl opens and sludge will be ejected from the bowl. This is what happening of the of a marine purifier. Here we can say after passing through central passage, untreated oil is carried by centrifugal force towards the periphery. So they will there is due to the centrifugal force, the untreated oil will be moved to the periphery of the board. Then it will pass through a disc stack. This, here is the actual separation takes place. In the channel between two disc stack, two forces will act on each solid and liquid particle. The particle is pushed upwards with, with the oil stream towards center, while the centrifugal force that it to periphery. So residual force on denser particles will drive them towards periphery. That means impurities, impure, impure particle will drive them to periphery. Less denser particle will come towards the center, then raise to the outlet connection. So separator heavy liquid continuously go into sludge tank through heavy liquid outlet and late liquid gets separated to the service tank. In particular intervals, bowl will open and sludge will be ejected from the bowl. This is what happening in the marine purifier. Thank you.